Hello, my peepers. Welcome to Shaleen's Creativity Room. It is, what is today? Friday, December 23rd. What's going on today? You had to think for a minute. What is today's date? Yep, I was not on yesterday morning, so we can look up both wisdom quotes. So, for the 22nd, here we go. Be patient and tough. Someday this pain will be useful to you. By Ovid. Okay, that's yesterday. Be patient and tough. Someday... This pain will be useful to you. Ovid. Okay, word of the day. Word, word, word of the day. Word, 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 word of the day. And it's Psalm. Psalm, P-S-A-L-M. I thought it was Psalm, but there's no, it doesn't show an L. Okay, it's, as a noun, it's a sacred poem or song. As a verb, it's to sing a poem or song. Or, yeah, to sing, ugh, sing a poem or song. Okay, now, today's wisdom quote, happiness is the default state. It's what's there when you remove the sense that something is missing by Naval Ravikant. Happiness... is the default state. It's what's there when you remove the sense <sighs> that something is missing. Naval Ravikant. Okay, and today's word of the day. Word, word, word of the day. Word, 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 word of the day. And today's word is pointillage, right? Pontiage. Pontiage, that's not what it looks like. Pontiage. There's L's, they don't pronounce the L's. It looks like pointillage. Point, 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 I don't know how she pronounced it. Pont, Pontias, Pontias. It's a noun, a style of painting in which small dots are applied to the canvas, also known, known as, I thought it was pointillism. It's probably pontillism. I don't know. I don't know. I always said pointillage. <laughs> and I've actually done this in coloring challenges.
Okay. And I used my pen instead of my green one. What was I thinking? Okay, there is that. Oh, my Versa battery's low. Okay, let's go charge my Fitbit. Okay, where is it? Uh, there it is. No, 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 no. No, no. Let's get that sucker charged. I got everything charging. I plugged in everything last night that needs to be charged. My power, um, my power supply thing. What do you call that? The backup battery power thing is uh, charged charged overnight. I'm leaving it charged in. Okay, so today is Friday. Friday. Weather, we don't want to know. Okay, so this is the weather. 37. And dropping fast. Um, hold on. 37, windy with snow showers evolving to a steady snow. Morning high of 37 with temps falling sharply to near 10. Winds west-southwest at 25 to 40 miles per hour. Chance of snow 90%. 1 to 3 inches of snow expected. Winds could occasionally gust over 50 miles per hour. Humidity 70%. Sunset 441. Now, we do have all kinds of warnings, okay? So, for the blizzard warning, okay, the blizzard warning, is 7 a.m. today until 7 a.m. Sunday. Okay, then we have a storm warning. It's not a watch, it's a warning now. Warning. And this remains in effect from 1 p.m. this afternoon until oh until 7 p.m. Saturday the heavy freezing spray we've got some weird weather heavy freezing spray remains in effect from 1 p.m. this afternoon to 4 p.m. Sunday So this was supposed to last till Monday morning. Now it's saying till Sunday morning. Then we have a special weather statement. Arctic cold front will bring a rapid change over to snow with very gusty winds and a rapid drop in temperatures this morning. Yeah. Wind gusts expected as high as 65 to 70 miles per hour today into tonight. Okay, so yeah, it's just going to be plain old nasty all the way around. We, yeah, we are going to do, <laughs> we're going to have many Simons. We're going to have. Cold. Cold. <coughs> See, we don't have anything for wind. Cold and windy. And snow. Snow. <laughs> oh my gosh. Too funny. 
and we'll do this green. <coughs> Be ready. There we go. <laughs> I'm picking. I'm picking on a friend. Don't mind me. Okay. Let's see. I'm tired. I didn't go to bed till 2 a.m. And Scott woke me up at 9, quarter to 9, going, I need that grocery list. I needed more sleep. Because he's going now to go get the groceries before it gets nasty out. And watch, he probably won't be able to get half the stuff that I want for Christmas Day. Okay, today's National Day. Today's National Day. Well... I don't know what that is. We'll do with National Roots Day. Okay. I want to watch Christmas movies all day. Okay. And we have my crafty planner. Eyes are getting watery. Hey, because I'm tired. Okay. So we did not do a morning video yesterday because I was getting ready for the concert. And I'll tell you about that in a little bit. I finished the daisy chain last night and I worked on Rovera's Halloween. And I'm going to continue working on that until it's finished, which could possibly be today. Um, and then I'm going to work on Curly Tailed Rosie until next Saturday morning. So, yeah, I should get a lot done on Rosie. So there is that. today. I have a few things to do today. You know, I keep putting in... Why is it never there? Okay, Wednesday. How did we do? We did do the dishes. We did switch purses. Cross-stitched movies, audiobook. Okay, today...
Okay, so today is Friday. <clears throat> I have a few things to do today. Okay, what I'm listening to, what I'm cross stitching, and let's put this up. Happy holidays. Okay. Home for Christmas. Um, let's see, what are we doing today? Any of this? No. Let's see, are we doing any of this? Fun with friends, because I always have fun with friends in Zoom. Christmas grocery shopping. Scott's out doing that one today. I think that's it. Yeah, that's good. Okay, dishes, vacuum. Everything charged. Bathroom. Okay, audio book. Cross stitch. Christmas movies. Okay, so the audio book is playing nice. And the cross stitch. R18 Halloween Rovars. So there's that. Okay, so my sister bought me and my mom tickets to go see the Trans Siberian Orchestra. She was picking me up at quarter to 11. She made reservations for lunch for noon. Because we were told this this place gets packed. It's Pearl, Pearl Street Grill and Brewery in Buffalo. So we get there and it's not busy. 
she's she's like, well, we probably didn't need reservations. So my mom and I ordered Reuben sandwiches and my sister ordered Chipotle chicken sandwich. They ate all theirs, but I know how my body reacts when I'm nervous and when anxiety kicks in. So I only ate half of my sandwich and I had two potato chips and they were homemade chips that were really, really good. So it's 1230 now. We're done eating. The doors don't open in the event center till two o'clock. So Missy's like, well, let's just sit here for a while. We'll ask the waiter if we can. And he said, yeah, sure. So we sat there waiting. And then all of a sudden it started getting packed in the restaurant. So we're like, well, let's go. You know, we got to find a parking spot in the garage. So we parked the car and we start walking to the elevator. Now it says we're on level three but we want walkway level four. So we get in the elevator and there's a star, you know, like how you have the star for lobby on, on hotels and that. This had a star that said walkway to level four. Missy goes, no, that's where we are. We want the star that's for the lobby. And I said, I don't know. It says walk to walkway level four. She's going, no, I don't think so. I don't think that's right. So we take it to the lobby, which is down to the bottom, to the ground level. So we have to walk across outside to get into the event center. And it's start and it's raining now. So we get in there and we gotta wait a while, which is I'm glad we did get there when we did because there wasn't hardly anybody in there. But we had to wait a while. So they finally open everything up and we go, you know, use the restrooms, everything, and we go find our seat, and my mom has the outside, so she's right on the end of the aisle, and I sat next to my mom, and Missy sat next to me. Concert was freaking amazing. So we had like 40 minutes from the time we sat down till the concert started, so my anxiety was starting to kick in. Now, I took my anxiety pill I take a half of one. I took that right after we finished eating, and it wasn't really helping. I mean, it probably did. It just didn't feel like it at the time. So we were waiting and looking around, and one of the guys that was working there, you know, that worked in our section, Missy asked him, did it, did it sell out? And he says, no, the seats hold 14,000 people. He said, there's only like 6,500 for this 3 o'clock show in the afternoon. He goes, but the 7.30 show tonight, there's over 10,000 people. So they're like, wow, that that's a lot. We're, so we're glad we went at 3 o'clock. <clears throat> I had tears in my eyes. I just... This was the best concert I've ever been to. Hugged my sister. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the Christmas gift. My mom says, we have to do this again next year. I'm like, I'm up for that, you know. We'll save $10 a month and go. Because we had a great time. Weather was not too bad. Um, when we came home, though, it was raining. But... Other than that, you know, no snow. It wasn't too cold out. It was okay. So we're leaving the concert, and I, Missy says, we want that walkway level four. Okay, yep, we'll go find that. So we found walkway level four, so you don't have to walk outside to the garage, parking garage. So we get off. Yeah, you know, you walk from the walkway into the parking garage. Missy goes, now we have to go get the car. And I said, but that's on level three. And she goes, no, we were on walkway level four. And I said, no, we were on parked on level three. We were supposed to take the elevator to walkway level four. And she sat there arguing with me. So she says, and we were parked across from the elevator. So we found the elevator. Walked across from her. Her car's not there. Imagine that. She goes, where's my car? I said, your car's on level three. 
And she's still arguing with me. She goes, fine. So we get on. The elevator takes a long time. The people in front of us said they had been waiting 10 minutes for the elevator. Now, normally, Missy and I would have taken the stairs down to the next level, but we had my mom who can't hardly walk, and she's got her cane. So we get on the elevator. She clicks the button for level three, and I said, see that button? It says walkway level four. That's where we're now. I said, but when we were on in the parking garage to go to the walkway, you were supposed to push that button. Oh, so we get off level three, go walk to where the car is, and lo and behold, there is her car. <laughs> and i like, I told you. She goes, yeah, 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 I'm stubborn. <clears throat> okay, then she's apologizing a lot to my mom for doing all this extra walking that my mom shouldn't have had to do. Which, technically, she should have just gotten in the garage, got her car, and picked my mom up at the doors in front of the event center so my mom didn't have to do all that walking. Anyways, yes, the concert, uh, I can't even describe it, but I was told that this year's concert is on YouTube, so you can watch it. I, I I think it was the best concert I have ever been to. I've been to a lot of concerts, rock concerts and country. Been to a lot of them. This is the best concert I've ever been to and well worth the money. And the actually, the tickets weren't even that bad. And we had awesome seats. Oh, my God. We had awesome seats. So, in the in front of us was a family. There was probably oh, six to eight people. And uh, they had two little girls that were toddlers. The one little girl pretty much played on her mom's phone playing games throughout the concert. The other one slept through most of it. I don't know how she slept through all that noise. You know, the the music, I have no clue, but she slept through most of it. And the guy next to them that was with the family says, you can tell your friends that you listened to ACDC. <laughs> yeah, oh my gosh. But what an awesome experience. So, yeah. My mom was smiling throughout the whole thing. It wasn't too loud for her. It wasn't as loud as I thought it would be. But yeah, it wasn't too loud for her. She, The one thing she said was she did not realize it was all rock. She thought just a couple of their songs were. She didn't realize it was all rock music to Christmas music. But she absolutely loved it. And um yeah, so we want to make it a yearly thing. Too bad we didn't start this years ago when my mom was a little younger. Um, and she said that they said that the, they, the Trans-Siberian Orchestra has been together since 1999. So, yeah, what an experience, though. Oh, my gosh, if you ever get a chance to go, I would go. But if you do not like... Um, strobe lights and blinking lights and laser lights that would not be for you because there is a lot of that flashing lights and all that going on throughout the whole concert <clears throat> but yeah now i want to watch it on youtube on my big screen tv and put on surround sound on my stereo so yeah i'm looking forward to doing that this weekend too but yeah well well worth well worth it. The traffic getting out of the parking garage was horrific. And, you know, nobody would let my sister out of her parking spot. And finally someone did. But we were sitting there a long, long time. And then we got on the throughway. And the throughway was bumper to bumper crazy traffic. And she just thinks, and all heading 
east like we were and she's like I think people are trying to get out of Dodge before the storm hits because it was crazy at one point we got behind a tractor trailer had no lights and then they would flicker on and then they would flicker off so he had a short somewhere as a Missy and I are like he needs to get off the throughway he's gonna get a ticket he needs to get off at the nearest exit but he didn't get off at the nearest exit you know and we passed a couple exits and he wasn't getting off and I'm like he's got to know he has no lights other than that it was good and Missy said <clears throat> that we would do the three o'clock show again not the 730 because it is it the concert lasts for two and a half hours but all of us are trying to get out of the parking garage we didn't get out till after 630 now you've got the people trying to get in because the concert starts at 730 so I don't even know where those people were to get into the parking garage because we got there early these people were not going to get there as early as they wanted it was it was crazy just crazy we sat in the parking garage for like half an hour <clears throat> but uh, awesome 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 so that is what happened yesterday we had an awesome time like I said and I keep using that word but I'm sorry it was amazing I, mm, yeah just go if you ever get a chance to go go well worth it but that's it for today my peepers you all have a great day there will be a morning video tomorrow if we have power if there's no power there's no morning video um I will not be doing a video on Christmas Day. It's a holiday. I take the day off. But you all have a Merry Christmas. And um, hopefully I will be on tomorrow morning. Love you guys. Bye-bye.